What's up, everybody? Crypto Muscle coming to you with another YouTube video. Oh, yeah, international now, worldwide syndicated. Because the phenomenon is here in crypto land on the Crypto Muscle Network. Pumping iron and pumping crypto coming to you with another YouTube video. The most electrifying YouTuber there is, just saying. Coming to you with another video, so let's do it. Let's talk about it, all right? CoinHub. It's been a couple days since I last talked about CoinHub. And think of it as you may. Think of it as you want to think of it as. I'm just looking at it as just another passive opportunity. All right? And, you know, like I said in my previous video, every platform has a story, right? Every platform has a CEO. Every platform has life. And every platform dies and goes away, right? That's the thing about it. Platforms in general. None of them last forever. And we just take it as it is, day to day. All right? And if there's enough traction and attraction, that's what happens with these platforms. They go. And then once it fizzles or they stop paying, well then, then you know that's the end of the road. And that's how it is, right? It's it's the risk that we take when we go into all these platforms, right? And you know we've we've been through it all, right? Fake CEOs, real CEOs, pay, slow paying, non-paying. We've done it all, right? Fast platforms, slow paying platforms. I'm just saying, we've, we've done it all. We've done smart contracts, uh, you name it, right? A little bit of token buy. This is what we do on this channel, all right? And so the question is, all right, and, and I can answer the question for you right now. You as a person decide what you want to do when you go and investigate the platforms you're in, right? If you find something that you feel like some kind of way about, then you know your answer. You feel some kind of way, then you don't do it, right? You don't make yourself do it. You got to feel comfortable about it, right? And I and on my channel, I always talk about the power of choice, all right? Because the power of choice is important. You make that decision. No one else does. And I offer an array of choices, and a selection, as you may, ranging from Pegasus all the way down to Bullwise Hype, all right, and everything else in between. And so with that, you make a decision, the power of choice. There is a choice you could make. It's either a yes or a no. And simply put, that's it, right? You jump on the next muscle, you know, crypto muscle train, because the train keeps rolling, all right? Tons of opportunities. I can tell you right now, I'm looking at another, oh, uh, man. For not hypes, but mid-level-ish type platforms um, and up, I'm looking at at least two more right now, presently, and go on from there. So... You know, that's just how it is. Oh, and speaking of hypes, man, opportunities on hypes. There's tons of hypes that come out every day, and I don't join them all or nothing. So it's just a matter of picking and choosing. So that's the power of choice that I do, right? I, I, I pick certain ones that I feel good about and avoid a lot of others. So here we are with CoinHub now, all right? We refocus back on CoinHub. And, you know, it's... It is what it is, right? And the opportunity is here, right now, as we speak. All right. This is just maybe the front cover of what they do here now. Let's take a look at this. Oh, actually, I got to log in. Let me log in real quick to my MetaMask. And so here we are, right here. All right. Let me refresh this page. Make sure we are reconnected there. All right. We are reconnected. And this is where it's at here. My MetaMask is connected. All right, so this is where it's at. Um, last 
think the last day or so, I think the last time I talked about it was about two days ago, probably. Um, maybe even three the most. So, with that, let me see here. All right, I'll double check. Let me see here. Where am I? Where am I? Ooh. All right, let me go roll it back to the front. Let's see, the last I talked about Coin Hub was three days ago. All right, so three days ago, time has passed. So, during that time, going back to here, um, you know, I, I'll go into the income portion here and I'll claim these uh, collections here, as you may. So, instead of clicking on each of these, I just do boom, boom. And just like that, it goes in. So, it showed 134 originally on the dash before I clicked on all that. So, let's see what it looks like now. It's so up to 147 now. And so that's what I do, right? I just uh, come in every day, once a day, and if I see something, I'll click on it. Boom, 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 right? And then it's in the balance. All right, and then that's where it shows up at. And so uh, two things, all right? Because uh, I got a comment about it. And it's happened to me too. Right? I'll be straight with you. It's happened to me. So I had like a $500 balance originally in my MetaMask because I had a 200 something dollar. All right, let's look at the withdrawal. Let's see if it shows withdrawal history. Let me see here. Okay, so you can see the withdrawal history. These two balances here was in my wallet, all right? And these two balances are, were gone. <laughs> it just showed zero, right, as it shows right now. So at first I was thinking, is it me <laughs> or is it CoinHub, right? And so this is during this whole time right now that you know, they're trying to start, quote-unquote, CoinHub 3.0, right? I guess right now we're in 2.0. Um, so they're trying to get 3.0 started, and you got to, you know, two clicks of ETH gas fees, right? You got to pay, you got to click on to reconnect, right? Because it's going to ask you to activate or whatever if you were trying to claim this or withdraw, right? It's going to say, please activate, right? It'll pop up. So you click on it, and it's going to ask you to pay a gas fee, right? And then it, you do that. Pay it through. It's going to ask you again because I learned in the chat. It says you got to do it twice, all right? So you do it twice. And once you do it twice, it actually did go through. And with that... Um, this is what I did, all right? So for whatever reason, it showed a zero balance, all right, on the MetaMask. So I don't know what occurred, what happened. So this is what I did, all right? I collected that 634 because that showed up as a balance. And what that was to me is uh, I don't know what that, I don't know how it came about to be 634. I mean, it kind of looks like it's in conjunction with these two amounts, but I really don't know. But what I did was to play it safe, I took that amount out and then I opened up another MetaMask account. So I'm trying to stay a step ahead. Uh, if there's something going on with this, I really don't know. And I moved it on to the muscle train. So I opened up another MetaMask and as soon as I received that withdrawal, I moved it over to that to another MetaMask account that's not connected to this. Just so if there is anything weird, which I'm not sure I can't verify going on, there's no one in the chats or even mentioning it, then at least it's in another wallet and they can't touch it now. Whereas here, you know, this is the wallet I've been using for this account or for, uh, you know, for CoinHub here. So this is where I stand right now. 
$147 is the balance. And technically, I could just say max it and start another pledge plan, right? And kind of have another, you know, quote unquote, perpetual income flowing, right? If I wanted to. Or I could just hit uh, withdraw and that's what I'm going to do. So that's that. I'm going to max out that withdraw. It's going to go into my MetaMask. And once it does, I'm going to move this amount into the other MetaMask account offline. So I'm going to, I'm going to disconnect this offline. And then that way, without any sort of way that this thing is connected, I'm going to transfer because you could easily transfer between your two MetaMask accounts, right? Because let's, for example, let's just look at this, right? And I want to send, it's going to say transfer between my accounts. So I just click on that. And all right, let me just do it here. Then you see, I could just move it. So I'm in account two right now currently. So once it's there, I'll just say, okay, I want to transfer it to this account, which I did. That 634 amount is now in the, in the muscle train one. And then from there, it's there. <laughs> is not connected to this at all whatsoever and that's what i'm going to do i'm just going to just collect it and put it back into another metamask just to play it safe all right and uh we'll see what happens though that's what i'm doing right now and we're going to see what happens so i got a little bit of eth in here i took out the rest of my eth i had about shit, i don't know how much of eth i had i think i had like four eth in here i moved that or actually yeah i moved it I spread it out between, uh, I'll, tell, I'll tell you guys what I did. I moved some into this account. I moved some into this account. I left a little bit in here just for gas. So when I need to interact with this for gas purposes, it's to get the, you know, the money out for gas. And that's what I'm doing with it right now. So once it arrives in my MetaMask, I'm going to move that 147 into that Muscle Train account. That's my plan. And that's what I'm going to do. So once it gets there, it's going to get there. It takes about uh, 10 to 15 minutes or so. Um, and then once it gets there, I'll just do it all over again. So we'll see what happens. But so far, it's it's this is what has been uh, happening with me. I'm just sharing with you guys my experience. And um, I mean, it is, you know, passive income on this application. And I think they're using the name uh in itself to kind of just draw eyes to it right every platform has a story every platform tries to find ways to uh you know stand out and set things in motion to draw attention and this is their way of drawing attention to me i kind of look at this as what daisy is trying to be all right daisy is trying to be something like this where they are using their little AI and uh, coming up with something here that the this is what CoinHub is doing, all right? And we could take control of that because we can't take control of what Daisy's been doing. And this pledge keeps going up every day, 418 you know, million now. And this 60 days thing, once it tops out at 30 million, right, which is getting pretty close, then that'll be the cutoff of this uh, 60 days program here for this FUB token. So looks like it's starting to get pretty close there as it's just another, uh, was it, 3 million away from doing so. And then they're going to cut off this... Um, plan i guess you could say so keep in mind if you're interested in doing this fub there's a little uh, telegram room that will unload <laughs> and take your fub if you want to sell it to them um or not you can just hold on to it because supposedly there's some big things happening with this fub and some people say this is actually a better deal that you earn you know income along with fubs and this so i don't know um I'm just going to just continue the course that I'm doing right now. So 
Links down below, comment down below, let me know what you think, and I'll see you in the next one.